Hey, what's up guys? I've got a cool unboxing here for you. This is, as you can see right in front here, uh, the Omen Collection, the Deluxe Edition apparently. I don't know if they're going to have a regular edition at some point, but um, the Deluxe Edition um, from Scream Factory, Shout Factory, which is really, well, actually, what day is it? I don't know if it's releasing tomorrow. It's, today is the 7th, Monday the 7th, and I assume it's releasing either tomorrow or maybe next week, I guess. Sometimes I get it a little bit early, but uh, they haven't done that in a while, so I think it's releasing tomorrow. Um, or next week, I guess, I don't know. But, um, anyway. Uh, I've got the Omen Collection here, and I did get the Lithograph too, apparently, which, um, this is the first time I've actually seen it. It's just the same artwork, I guess. But, uh, that's cool. And this is five films. The first four uh, original films, and then the remake from 2006. And I only know that because I remember when they released it, it was... June 6, 2006, so it was 666, and I swear to God, that's the only reason they even made the movie, because they wanted to have that release date. It was like a Tuesday or something, too. So they had to have... Anyway, yeah. It was kind of dumb, but... Uh, I've, I've actually only seen part of that movie, the, the the remake, and I don't remember anything about it. I know there's a, a kid named Damien, and he's like the devil's son or something, but otherwise, I know actually very little about this series, which is kind of why I bought the set, because I had don't own any of the films, and I figured I may as well get the definitive editions of them, so. I figured, what the heck, this was, um, about 55 or 60 bucks, I think, off of, um, uh, Shop Factory, Screen Factory site, um, with the, with the, with the poster, I guess. Um, I don't know how much it's going for now, I assume around that much on Amazon and Best Buy and whatnot. About, I'm guessing about 60 bucks. There are five films here. And uh, so around 12 bucks each, which I guess isn't that bad considering. Um, actually, let me get the plastic off here because it's getting kind of glary in here. I like these sets when they have specifically uh, single Blu-ray cases for each movie and that they have this thick box set. I guess I could do this. I know some people do it like this where they just have the, this, the, the entrance cut off and then they take them out, but I don't do that. I like taking the whole thing off because I want to see all the artwork and stuff and take the backer off and that's just how I roll. That's cool. And this is this comes right off. Let's just do that right now actually. I like doing that too because you leave this glue on here for a long time. It uh, might actually take the artwork. And right now we got lucky and nothing came off, so that's good. It's just the back, which I said is the poster. Kind of cool. It's a Damien and then some devil dog and a bunch of crows or ravens. I wonder if there are three eyed ravens. I doubt it. Uh, this set looks pretty good. The corners are about what you'd expect from a shipped package, although it looks pretty good. Um, just a little bit of white down there, but that's not a big deal. So, yeah, good set. And I know you're supposed to make sure you knock on it, but it's very sturdy cardboard. I like that. And now, remember, you have been warned. Okay. And there's a little synopsis there, I assume, for all of them. Uh, experience the ultimate in horror with the Omen Collection, featuring all four original films, as well as the, re the 2006 remake that kept audiences glued to the screen with white-knuckled terror. I don't know if that's true, but, you know. Packed with hours of chilling special features, this five-disc set includes 1976's The Omen, a new 4K remaster, um, Damien Omen 2, in which Damien discovers his identity. Uh, the Final Conflict, in which he realizes his full power. And Omen 4, Omen 4, The Awakening, in which a demonic force returns in the form of a wicked young girl. The Haunting Legacy comes full circle with the riveting 2006 version, including stirring performances from Gregory Peck, Lee Remick, William Holden, Lee Grant, Rosano Brazzi, uh, Sam Neill, Mia Farrow, Liev Schreiber, and more. The Omen Collection presents the height of sheer terror. Get ready for hours of the ultimate evil. That's cool, I guess. And there's a new 4K remaster of the first film only. I'm assuming the rest are just regular 2K masters, or I guess just HD remasters. Um, and then there's new interviews with a bunch of people from all the movies, looks like. And writers and production artists and stuff, yeah. Uh, and then the rest of this, I'm assuming it's just taken over from other releases. It doesn't say new next to them, so I'm not sure. Um, but the documentary, apparently, that's kind of neat. 
uh, another documentary, 666 The Unrevealed, with total galleries, commentaries, featurettes, trailers, TV spots, video spots, and much more apparently. So that's cool. And that's from Shout Factory. And these are the films. Okay, here's the dates. The Omen was 1976, which is 111 minutes. Uh, Damien Omen 2 was 78, 107 minutes. The Final Conflict uh, was 81, 108 minutes. Uh, Omen 4 of The Awakening was 91 and 97 minutes. And The Omen Remake in 2006 was 110 minutes. And they're all rated R except for the fourth film, which is not rated. So I assume that was just um, like a direct-to-video film or something. And then it's a, these are Fox films, and uh, Screen Factory released them. And there's the little FBI warning. And then all the DTS Master Audio stuff, Region A, although, is that true? I think that actually is true for these, for uh, Screen Factory. So cool. Let's take a look see here. Like I said, the, it's a nice, sturdy box. Whoa. Let's put this off here. Okay, so here's the first film. You have been warned. The Omen. Um, I'm not going to read all this, though. You can pause it if you want to read it. But, um, you know, absolutely riveting, thoroughly scary experience. An orphaned infant for their own will. Satanic orphans. Yes, like I said, I don't know a whole lot about these films. I just know that it's supposed to be like the devil's child or a demonic child of some sort. So I'm looking forward to checking these out. It's, you know, it's like right in the middle of um, 31 Days of Horror, so I plan on watching at least the first one to see how it is. Let's we see his special features here. So we got the 4K remaster, a new interview with author David Seltzer and actress Holly Palance and more. Commentary, another commentary, uh, audio commentary, lots of commentaries. Introduction, Taylor, just unusual stuff. So that's cool. It's nice to just have it even if it's already been released, just to have them all in one set. So that's cool. Damien Omen 2, the first time was only a warning. Because it said you've been warned, you know? William Holden and Lee Grant. Cool. Damien Omen 2. And this was in 78, I think it said. Right? Yeah, so two years after the first one. Um, new interviews with actors and Lee Grant. Commentary. Yeah, the usual stuff. Like I think I already said. There's the disc. Now these are released, I mean... The, the four films, anyway, I think, right? I think it's... The, I forget. I think there was a four-film set in that terrible box set, like the cardboard that they released from Fox years and years ago on Blu-ray. So these have had these have been on Blu-ray before. Although, I think uh, Omen 4 might not have been. This, this one, I think... I think the other set was these first two films and then the remake. Although, I don't quote me on that because I'm not certain. But I think that this is the first time The Awakening has been released. I think I read that. But I'm not 100% certain. Like, I don't know. I'm just babbling now. I remember this cover, this VHS cover. But I don't think I've ever seen the film. And apparently he's the president. Interesting. The power of evil is no longer in the hands of a child. So is that Damien all grown up or something? The final. Con is this just called The Final Conflict? Not The Omen or anything? Hmm. Yeah, Damien Thorne. Cool. So yeah, I don't know anything about this storyline. I'm looking forward to checking these out. I doubt I'm going to get a chance to watch all these, but um, I guess we'll we'll see. So yeah, it doesn't say a new transfer, just a new interview here. And then a new commentary and the usual stuff. Documentaries on here. Is there a documentary on the other one? Uh, no. And this is 1980-something? 80, 80, 81. Yeah. Pretty cool. There's some background out there, too of uh, Jesus on the cross because of course gotta have some sacrilege in there too Omen 4 The Awakening cool there's the synopsis again and with a new interview and that's basically it and then this documentary that's kind of cool hmm. this is from 90 something I think or just 1990 91 okay so 10 years after the third film Same, yeah, it's the same. Background art. 
and the remake, which, like I said, I've, I've seen, I think, some of this, but I don't know. From the Eternal Sea, he rises, creating armies on either shore, turning man against his brother until man exists no more. Crazy. Um, I'm pretty sure this was panned by critics and stuff. I, like I said, I don't, I don't know. <coughs> it came out um, 13 damn years ago, so I would have been 23, something like that. I wouldn't have cared. I wasn't as into horror back then. Haunting a top notch scary movie. Richard Roper. So he liked it, I guess. Hmm. Um, so yeah, actually, no new stuff here. Just the regular. Uh, this, I don't know if it's the same release from before, but because um, this was released before too, just like the other ones besides um, Fork. But it looks like nothing new here, just repackaged. So that's cool, I guess. Commentary, uh, featurette, and then that other. That document. No, it's a featurette. Never mind. And then. Extended scenes and extended editing. So, that's cool, I guess. Oh, shit. Go crazy with the discs here. Okay, yeah, it's fine. There's a scene from the film. So, yeah. I guess we can take a look at the poster here. Hold on. What do you think of this artwork? I'm okay with it. I don't know. And the poster, I haven't had a bad poster since I started actually putting these in um, thicker uh, tubes and actually putting cappers on them and then actually, you know, putting a seal on here so they won't spool around and stuff. So that's cool. Let me get this off of here. And I have a bunch of lithographs and I can't do anything with them because they're all, all their sizes are weird. I actually don't know which size this is. Is this... I think it's the same size as all the other ones. This feels a little thinner, actually. I don't know if that means anything, but the other ones I feel like are much thicker than um, this one. This feels like an actual poster. I think it's a lithograph, didn't it? I don't know. Um, so yeah, that's pretty cool. The Omen. So sticky on the back there. I don't know what that is, it's just some glue. So yeah, very cool. Okay, so. Yeah, cool beans. Um, yeah, I guess that's it. Um, I'm looking forward to checking out the first one for sure this month. Um, the rest, we'll see what happens. I hope I like it, because if I like it, I'll end up wanting to watch the rest. Although I assume the rest aren't you know, high quality or anything, but uh, I'm hoping the first one is, but um, yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching guys. And uh, I'll see you again next time for more um, random unboxings. <laughs> There's been a couple things I got in the last couple weeks that I didn't showcase here because I didn't um, either didn't get it in time to actually give it a chance or I just didn't feel like doing it. I got a couple things that I were just like, eh, like vampires and something else. I forget. But anyway, thanks for watching guys. Um, I appreciate it just watching stuff even if I don't put out stuff all the time but you know I'm random like that so thanks for watching I'll see you again uh, there's at least one more thing coming out this month um, maybe two actually depending on how I if I get it in time but then I plan on unbox and we'll see I guess so thanks for watching and I will talk to you guys later bye bye